I remember when mom was pregnant with you. I remember when you came home with a little blue ribbon in your hair, and I was like, didn't you do that for girls, not boys? <laughs> it's a blue ribbon. <laughs> yeah, it's ribbon there. Yeah. I remember, I changed your diapers. I remember your first day of school. I remember you coming to work with me at the flea market on Sundays, and the two of us working our asses off to try to have a little money in our pocket. And I remember you, mostly when you were a little younger, um, as kind of a, more of a shy person. And the kind side of this party might not know this about Colin, but when Colin was a lot younger, he was very anxious and shy, and we weren't exactly sure what was going to happen. And, uh, <laughs> Adapted, you know, in a way, it's like beautiful the way human beings can evolve. And he built a house out in the woods. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Before my eyes, my younger brother, who I always thought was kind of shy and introverted, became like the hub of this whole social network. I would come home from college and like drive down my driveway, and there was like 20 cars parked on the driveway, and I was buying a lot of 30 packs, and I felt awkward about it. But it was a. Uh, it's been awesome calling as your older brother to watch this whole transition and to watch you really grow into someone who used to keep yourself a little more. And I know you're still nervous as shit all day today, but you've been great job. <laughs> and I really think at this point now, I think I'm going to speak for all of our family that in some weird way, you've become the glue of our family. Wow. Like, like you've been a rock. You're the one who's always had your shit together. You've had your money right. You've had yourself right. You've kept it together. So, Connie, it makes me so proud to stand behind him as the two of you begin to start a family together. And knowing that he's so solid and so excited about starting a family for the two of you. And, you know, like, yeah, for that. Is cool. yeah. something for the Vermont crew. Can I hear it from the Vermont crew? Yes! Thank you all so much for taking in my brother. Um, <laughs> it was hard for us, and it was hard for Colin, man. I'm not, Connie knows, it was like two months of phone calls every night with Colin being like, I love her, but I don't want to move up there, I'll take it down, I'll take it and honestly, it got really tired. After like the first week, I was like, I don't know, may I make a decision? But, <laughs> it took a lot of months, and Connie, I think it says a lot about how in love with you he was. He was really scared about making this family, but he did, and I think we all saw today how much of Colin is committed to you. And, um, I love you both for that. So cheers to you.